welcome back to my channel it's your girl lily here and i'm back with another video another banger you feel me so today 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 i'm doing something different we're doing a wig install with this wig get out of here bitch get out of here bitch i don't know where the wig is from forgot but that's the wig i look like a grease ball right now because cocoa butter is on my face if that is bothering you except that way thank you it shouldn't <laughs> let me stop but yeah the hair is freshly washed it's somewhat dry because I was going to do this straight out the shower, but I was like, it's doing a lot of drippage. So we're going to let it um, somewhat air dry. We're getting ready to go to a party tonight. So that's how we're doing our hair. The party starts in about seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Four hours. It shouldn't take me that long to do this. The longest part is the braiding. Um, let's see how long that braiding takes me to do. But the longest part is the braiding. So let's let this hair out. Oh, Lord. It's still very wet. The part that was in the clip. It's still very wet. I'm going to get a t-shirt and we're going to scrunch it up to get the, get the water out. I'm also answering some questions that some viewers dropped on my instagram if you don't follow me on instagram all that stuff all that information is in the description on every video so go ahead and follow me but i have some questions that people asked either anon anonymously or just straight up asked me on instagram using the question feature i'm not gonna let y'all sit through me blow drying my hair so i'm gonna edit this part out and I'm going to just come back to y'all when the hair is blow dried and I'm in the process of braiding. So I changed the camera angle and before I start blow drying, I like to take this heat protectant on my curls. That may be a little bit too much, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Again, here's the heat protectant that I use. Before I start doing any type of blow drying at all, I like to comb out my hair and I like to see how poofy... I can get it without heat because I like to use as minimum as heat as possible and just by combing my hair like this since it is wet it's not really as dry right now that's the only reason why I'm going to use a blow dryer because my hair is wet but as you can see it's still puffy like it just got puffy just from me combing it out with a wide tooth comb y'all my hair is like 75% dry right now um, I'm gonna braid it, I'm gonna corn roll it, but we gonna, we gotta hurry up because I wanna try to be done with this by 10 o'clock and it's 8 o'clock. We got two hours, so I don't know why I had to count that. That's embarrassing. Uh, my rat tail comb broke. I got a rat tail and I got a comb. I don't got a rat tail comb no more. Um, why, why it break? I was like, and it said, I said, oh. The woman was too stunned to speak. Y'all, let me stop playing. I got two hours to, I got max an hour to cornrow this hair. And I think I'm gonna do like 10, 10 braids. So that means like three, six, six. No, eight, eight. Four on the side and then two in the middle. I don't know. We'll see how it goes because I don't even remember uh, how many I did last time. But I'll come back to y'all when this when I look like Lil Bow Wow. Okay, so as you can see, I'm looking like Lil Bow Wow. Oh my god, that hurt. But um. I had to be ready by 10 o'clock. It is currently 9.14. So, let me put this big cap on. 
really quick, real fast, quick in a hurry. The ears are cut. Where's my spray? I'm going to spray this on, get this nice and touched, and I'll be right back when that's on. Because, it, yeah, we on a crunch time, baby. Okay, so y'all, your girl is looking bald. Yes, y'all. I know I got this big ass hole in the wig cap. I ain't have time to take it off and put on another one because I was on a time limit. Normally, when I do wig installs, I do not have a big ass hole in the wig cap because that's not okay. But for the time being, I was going to make it okay. I was going to make it okay. But editor lay out. So. I'm going to go ahead and put this wig on. This wig install is all over the place because it's going to be a lot of cuts, editing. I'm also in the process of making TikToks. Um, yeah. So this is the wig. Let me show you the wig. She needs to be calmed out or whatever, but this is her girl. Back, y'all. We back and I'm better. I want you bad as ever. Okay, so we're gonna take this wax stick. I already sprayed some of this in there, but now we're gonna take this wax stick and just try to get it as flat as possible. And that's on what, and that's on period. So now, y'all, I'm gonna just take this in sections, do the do, wax it, wax stick, wax it, wax stick. Wask it, wask it, wask it. And each time I do a little wask it, I'm gonna just straighten that. Let me stop. I was straighten that. But yeah, um, I'm gonna come back when I have like only one side to do. This is the lace. I finished the hair, and that's on what, and that's on period. Before I end the video, let's answer some questions. I was supposed to be answering questions while I was doing my hair, but your girl was rushed. So now I got time. Let's answer some questions. Question. Are you talking to anyone? No. Who's your last IG search? <laughs> a dude that I used to talk to because I just came back from a party, y'all. And she was like, who is that? So I had to show her the Instagram. What is a thing you're looking forward to this summer? Spending time with my friends, like doing summer stuff. You know, like late night drives, random activities, that type of stuff. Least favorite fit you've thrown on this year? I don't really know. I can't really think that far back. Because I feel like all my fits are like, you know, period. All my fits are warm. I'm that girl on campus. I'm that I'm that girl on campus. Let me stop. Uh, favorite fit you've thrown on this year? All of them. Because like I said, I'm that girl. And that's on one and that's on period. Best piece of advice to give to upcoming students? Um, I would say... Don't feel like you're alone. Imposter syndrome is real. Everyone goes through it. I'm still going through it right now. Like, there's always someone to talk to. If you feel alone on campus, talk to the people back home. Call some of their friends up that you have back home. Call your, call your mom, your dad, your uncle, your aunt, anybody. Because I know it can be alone on campus sometimes, if not all the time, but just know there's always going to be a person there for you. You're never, you're never alone. Where do you see yourself in five years? I see myself making that bank from YouTube. Your girl is going to get six figures on YouTube. That's where I see myself. I see myself just being successful. And I'm going to just put that in the air. I don't know. 
There's many ways to be successful. I just see myself being successful. I don't see myself having a set path to being there, but I will be there in the next five years. I will be successful. I will have six figures. I will be that girl. I would be someone's inspiration. Something you regret not doing this year. This school year, I would say I regret not getting my belly button pierced this school year. But definitely before this year ends, 2023, I will get my belly button pierced. Best thing you've learned while at school. I learned that I don't always need people around me to be happy. Because before college, I was so used to being around my best friend a lot. And I was so used to having that outlet to go to for a lot of things. And I was so used to her just being there and being there for me with anything. So when I got to college, obviously she's not here with me now. So I got used to being on my own and I got used to not really needing anyone to be happy. Because at the end of the day, no one can be my best friend. So I was like, girl, you just got to do, go with this alone. Like, stick through it. Like, girl, call her. I got her number. I can call her. She's not gone. She's still here. Why I'm over here being sad for her? I can FaceTime her. And she answered the phone. I can sex her. She texts me back. Like, just because we're not seeing each other every day. I learned to... Not be as, well, no, my best friend, my best friend, my best friend. But yes, that's still my best friend. But we learn to be away from each other. <laughs> I'm going to wrap up this video here. I appreciate you guys watching the vid again. This is the hair. It came out too good. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe on the video. And I will see you guys in the next one.